सो हाई गाइज होप यू आर डूइंग वेल और इस वीडियो में वील गोना डिस्कस कि आप कैसे 60 ऑन 60 इन केमिस्ट्री ला सकते हो आई टी टू जीरो टू फाइव के लिए राइट सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट्स बिगिन आई विल कट दिस वीडियो इन फोर पार्ट्स फर्स्ट आई विल एक्सप्लेन द इन ऑर्गेनिक पार्ट हाउ टू प्रिपेयर सेकेंड ऑर्गेनिक थर्ड फिजिकल एंड इन फोर पार्ट आई विल डिस्कस अ कॉमन टिप्स विच यू शुड डू फॉर ऑल द थ्री थ्री सब्जेक्ट्स राइट ऑर्गेनिक इन ऑर्गेनिक एंड फिजिकल सो या लेट्स मो विद द वीडियो ओके सो फर्स्ट वील डिस्कस फॉर इन ऑर्गेनिक सो फॉर इन ऑर्गेनिक जस्ट फोकस ऑन एन सी आर टी एंड जस्ट डोंट रीड एनी अदर पब्लिकेशन बिकॉज इन आई टी एज वेल एज इन अदर एग्जाम्स ऑल्सो ऑल द क्वेश्चन विल बी बेस्ड इन ऑन यूर एन सी आर टी ओनली फॉर इन ऑर्गेनिक एटलीस्ट इन आई ई टी ओके सो जस्ट डोंट रीड एनी अदर बुक्स स्टिक टू एन सी आर टी दैट्स इट लेट्स मो विद द सेकेंड सो द सेकेंड टिप इज डूइंग जई मैं क्वेश्चन एटलीस्ट पास फाइव इयर्स एंड इट्स नॉट लाइक यू शुड डू At I mean, if I say five years, then you should do only five years. You can go at max as you can. I mean, the better you do, like the more you do, the better you get. Yeah, that's the thing, right? So do more, the better you will get. So that's the thing. Do J M S question like at least past five years. Do as much as you can because the more rigorous practice you do, it will help you a lot in your exam. So that's it for the uh, inorganic part, like the special points for the inorganic part. Let's move with the organic section. Okay, so for organic. the first important point is doing a mechanism like uh, any reaction if you do you know the products it's it's fine you do a by heart thing of that uh, reactions or something like that it's fine but the mechanism you should know because at the in the exam it's not like you will going to memorize uh, you will get to recall everything what you have uh, memorized right so that's why do mechanism understand each and every reaction like how it happens because sometimes they will ask you a intermediate and the reactivity of the intermediate how stable it is like that question they can ask and if you don't know the mechanism of the reaction there is no use of uh, memorizing the final products right so that's why just go through the mechanism practice much with the uh, like mechanism and yeah at last you will do well in the exam at least for the organic part if you just do or mechanisms also let's move with the second okay so for the second point it's not very mandatory to do because lot of you have very less time you have to prepare for other subjects also but uh, oh, sorry other exams also but uh, what i think is if you are completely focusing on it so here is the second tip that uh, you can go with the ms chauhan organic uh, solving like uh, exercise book it's a very good book like it's very very good book like it's very good yeah so i really recommend you to do all the questions at least from the like the level 1 level 2 uh just go with that level 1 level 2 it's fine just don't go to level 3 or like the higher levels there are certain levels in that books I mean, I, as i remember when i used to prepare at my time so you can just do level 1 level 2 and that's it and it will really help you for your exam uh, for your it exam so let's move with the third okay so the third point is uh, it's common only but uh, yeah doing a jee mains pyq is uh, i say it in every yeah for every subject and in every line and i will just go gonna say this thing same for the physical chemistry also and uh, i didn't add this it into the common points because it's a really important point and generally people skip the uh, common points and just focus on the like the specific points which i have shared for the particular uh, subject right so that's why i'm mentioning j mains pyqs for each and every uh, section like physical organic and inorganic so yeah just doing a j mains pyqs and the same thing uh, past five years and if you can do the more just go with that so let's move with the uh, physical chemistry section right so yeah okay for physical chemistry it's not very aligned with the chemistry but more uh, aligned with the like physics thing like what you do in physics right so the first point which i should uh, which i would like to recommend you is like doing a formula revision in a physical chemistry whether it is any chapter structure of atom uh, any any chapter okay so just go with the formula revision because yeah in a uh, chemistry physical chemistry at least formula is very important uh, and if you don't know the formulas there is no physical chemistry to be very honest and if you can derive the formulas it's fine but there is no use of uh, deriving the formulas in uh, such a competitive exam you should uh, have it on your tips so yeah mug up the formulas just mug up yeah that's that's the only thing i have to tell you mug up the formulas and yeah let's move to the second point Uh, the second point is just like the second point which i have shared for your uh, organic section like uh, if you are specifically preparing for iit or je also maybe because it will also help you for je uh, that recommending a book uh, or doing a book questions so in a physical part i will recommend you narendra avasti 
and uh, narendra vasti is a very good book to be very honest and literally uh, he is like good you know uh, in physical chemistry you can solve narendra vasti and the same goes for it also that uh, just do the uh, like the first question like exercise 1 and 2 i guess i don't remember exactly the uh, how the book how much exercise were in the eight chapters but yeah just do the first or second exercise i guess and that will be really helpful for you in your preparation but yeah again if you are able to manage to do the, the book also then only you do it otherwise i will just share the material in the end of this video which you can refer it and still you can score the good the marks uh, but book i am re recommending because yeah some people really needs it so that's why i recommend it because uh, what happen is some people are there who have uh, completed almost all the syllabus and they need a uh, more and more practice uh, problems to solve so yeah that's why i am re recommending this books so let's move with the third point okay so the third point is uh, nothing but solving j men's questions and yeah i know you you are getting bored of listening this but it's very crucial for you guys and trust me it will really help you and you will you yourself will come to me and uh, after the exam and tell me that uh, yeah yeah the uh, j men's question really helps us to memorize the thing to like to solve the question in iit also because if you see in a broader way na uh, you will get to know that everything is same so yeah doing a jms question really helps you so do it and the same things goes doing a five years previous mc uh, pyqs and if you have time you can go for more but i guess it will be a lot for you because you have other uh, exams other chapters to study right other subjects to study so yeah that's very hectic for you so i don't recommend going much but if you can do it's good for you only so that's it for the like specific points for the specific subjects let's move with the common points so in the common points the first thing would be of course mock test giving a, a weekly test and i have told you this thing in every video of my score 60 on 60 uh, videos so yeah giving a mock test uh, at least one in a weekend on the chapter you have revised in the whole week is really important and uh, if you can able to or you must uh, i mean just give a full syllabus test at least uh, once in a two week or uh, once in a Three week is also fine because yeah, it it will become a hectic now because I know exams are uh, reaching and it's arriving closer and closer. So yeah, just give two or three like once in a two or three weeks. I don't mind in it, but yeah, just keep that uh, periodicity. Okay, just don't uh, do it like uh, giving a one test in a two weeks and after that giving it in a after a month. So don't do that. Don't break your uh, periodic uh, schedule, right? So yeah, that's the thing. And uh, if you are uh, like uh, worried about from where to give a mock test uh, so first i will uh, share a free uh, source from where you can give a mock test so for mock test you can refer a nt abhyas app in which uh, they have uh, shared a jmens question preparation uh, like and it has like uh, very like very much of the test which you can give and it will be like uh, it gone it never gonna finish because it has almost 100 or something full full length test i guess uh, and uh, yeah if you are able to do it in a like one test in a three or four days also then also it's not going to finish so yeah i mean it has a much a more content in the that app and it is uh, like it is brought by nta itself so yeah it will really help you so yeah that's it for the free now i will tell you about the paid so for the paid you can uh, refer to the siasta course in which they have shared a test series also you can take it because it is specifically for iits and uh, at this point i uh, siasta is the only channel which make a videos specially for iit so yeah i guess it's not uh, very bad to purchase the batch or purchase the test series you can buy and you can buy crash course as well because uh, yeah it is specifically for iit right so yeah you can go with the uh, batch uh, crash course also so that's it for the mock test uh, and yeah uh, okay so the another point i would like to mention is that i will share uh top 500 questions of math and go which are now updated this year they have updated i will update it in my excel sheet also you just go refer it if you don't want to do a book like which i have mentioned because yeah it's very time consuming i understand so i am sharing a top 500 question of math and go in which they have uh, included all the main main questions which can be asked you in your exam and which will have a high probability to appear in the exam so i will share it in the excel sheet in and i will share the excel sheet in description as well you can click on the link and refer the pdf of a math and go and i will also update it for physics uh, maths and uh, yeah physics and maths and for biology i have shared a vedantu top 500 questions you can refer it and i mean excel sheet which i have shared with you guys now it's really a gold mine gold mine link in which you can find all the materials for your iit preparation you don't have to go anywhere 
anywhere trust me you don't have to go anywhere you can just refer it and you can prepare for your exam accordingly so yeah that's it for this video and i will bring a next video on uh, important chapters of all the subjects i guess i have made for biology uh, so you can go and watch it uh, that is especially for a non bio students and in future i will bring for other subjects too so let's end the video at this point and yeah that's it for this video hope you like this video and yeah bye